I lived every young boy's dream. Jumping out of choppers, blowing shit up, stuff that most kids uh, can only dream of doing on a PlayStation. I came to Africa because I was looking for the next six months adventure. I saw a bull elephant that had had its face cut off. Tusks that had been taken, the whole elephant sitting there dead because some guy wants to have a tusk on his desk. What sort of ambush is this called? Linear. Linear ambush. Very I had good. money and I had skills that could help these rangers. Using the minimum amount of force required to get the job done. And I made the choice to, to dedicate my life to helping these guys protect these animals. After making that choice, though, I started to realise that every day I was going out on patrol and protecting one animal and coming home at night and putting another animal on the fire. And I knew I was... I knew I was full of shit. I created this flexible morality that was convenient for me, because if you don't hit meat, you're some sort of vegan that shrivels up into a string bean. In my mind, I justified it. There's enough cows on the planet, they're not gonna go extinct. But the longer I thought about it, the more I started to accept what I already knew. The easiest way to protect other animals is just not to put them in your mouth. This whole fantasy that we need meat to get our protein, it's actually bullshit. I mean, look at a gorilla. A gorilla will fuck you up in two seconds. Uh, what does a gorilla eat? I just do the same things as these big gray things out here that we're trying to protect, elephant and rhino. I just uh, stick to plans. The rangers that we support patrol five million acres of wilderness protecting these endangered species. But the actual biggest threat we have is the meat industry and the land that they are continually taking away from what we have left of these natural wilderness areas. Inch by inch, yard by yard, mile by mile, 